Immutable native backups are easier than ever to have with Veeam. Whether you're on-premises direct attached storage or you're looking at using object storage, you have so many options today with immutable native backups. Let's take a look at a quick demo to show you how easy it is with Veeam. So what we're looking at here is the Veeam Backup and Replication Console. I have a number of jobs in play already. Let's take a look at these two. One of these is backing up files. The other one is backing up image-based backups. So let's take a look at the file job. What I have here is a simple name for the file, and I've selected two different sources of unstructured data. One is a user path uh, for all of the users, and then one is a uh, collection of code. I'm gonna put that on the Veeam hardened repository with immutability. This is an easy way to have no additional Veeam cost for immutability on-premises on Linux, really easy to do. And then I'm also gonna show you this image-based backup job. So this is where Veeam is very well known. We have virtual machine backups, we have uh, VMware backups in this case, and I'm putting them on the scale-out backup repository with immutable native backups built into the name. So I know right away that these backups are immutable. Now you might not know about the scale-out backup repository, so let me show that to you real quick. This configuration here is two different storage resources holding our backups. One of them is on-premises direct attached storage with the hardened repository, and the other is immutable object storage. Both of these are on-premises. I have two different copies, two different immutability engines in play, and both of them so easy to set up. Let's take a look at the object storage configuration. So I've given it a name, and if you're not familiar with object storage, it's easier than ever to have it on-premises. In this particular configuration here, I have these backups marked as immutable for seven days. You can configure this dynamically with the properties of the repository. So that means that any image-based backup into that job will have that configuration. Likewise, the hardened repository, which is direct attached storage on Linux, will give you this type of configuration as well. Now the beautiful thing about this, which is a local on-premises Linux server with a lot of disk space attached to it, I can configure immutability in the same way. So I have a path, and in this particular example, I'm also using the fast cloning on XFS volumes, which is a great way to have a storage efficiency with no additional cost. And then as the object storage, similar type of configuration. I'm making these backups immutable for seven days. Now this is really easy to use, really easy to set up, and this scale out backup repository makes it very easy for me to have immutable native backups, and I can see these different backups that I've done, drive recoveries, restore to new places, all those things you would expect from Veeam. It's as easy as that. What I think is really important about immutable native backups is that you can have this on any type of storage, including object storage today. So if you like what you see, head on over to veeam.com and download a trial.